Ever wonder why birds can sit on power lines without getting a nasty shock? It seems like they should be toast, right? Well, the secret is something called electric potential. Think of it as the voltage difference between two points. For electricity to flow and give a shock, it needs a path to travel. When a bird is chilling on a single power line, both of its feet are at the same high voltage. Since there's no difference in potential, the electricity has no reason to flow through the bird's body. It just continues along the wire. Current only flows when there's a path from high voltage to low voltage, like the ground. If a person were to touch that same wire while standing on the ground, they'd create that path, and that's when things get dangerous. But what if a bird gets a bit ambitious and touches two different wires at the same time? Or maybe a wire in a grounded metal pole. That's the danger zone. By touching two points with different voltages, the bird completes the circuit and zap. So as long as our feathered friends keep their feet on one wire and don't touch anything else, they're perfectly safe. Electricity always takes the easiest path, and luckily for the birds, that's not through them. Thanks for watching.